Is Kate Middleton trapped? Why there are two to three different think pieces articles that I'm drawing together to come to this conclusion because again, things don't seem right. Hey guys, it's Marad Morali. Hopefully you guys are doing well today. Back again with another video. If you have not subscribed guys, click that button. It is daily and consistent content. Comment down below, give this video a thumbs up and let's get straight into this. So is Kate Middleton trapped? Is she going through something? An article via the mirror, well we all know she's going through something, has come out and stated that Kate's household rules are so strict, George, Charlotte and Louis cannot break them. And of course, it goes on to talk about how, you know, it's an odd article in this circumstance, I believe. Um, they have to do, they do have the help of a nanny, but I thought the nanny was let go. So I don't understand. But again, about household strict rules. Number one. Number two, King Charles, uh, his recent engagement was joking about how he was allowed to get out of his cage. What is he trying to insinuate when he states stuff like this? Is he implying that somebody like Kate is not allowed to get out of her cage, but he was allowed to get time out of his cage? What is a cage a metaphor for? You know, are people trapped in some kind of way? And I think Kate Middleton would be at this point because here is the thing. The world is way too big for her to not be seen in any way. There are far more bigger celebrities than Kate Middleton that have been cited left, right and center. So my belief is that this woman is not leaving the vicinity of where she is. She's staying there. The paparazzi, they're all going to have a bounty head on Kate to obviously take pictures of her because she's going to be worth a lot of money right now. They haven't gotten anything. And normally they would have of anybody in this position unless that person is not leaving a specific place. Another article, piece number four to this point, was that an article said that Kate and William had a frightening fight. And you're thinking, well, what's this about? And once you click the link of the article, it's just discussing how, you know, they're having disagreements in regards to what is going on or William is worried for her nothing in relation to that title. So why would they title it? Why would they entitle it by stating that she is having a frightening fight? Do they know stuff, the royal press, that we don't know and they're hinting it at us like they did with ushering Rose Hanbury's name everywhere in that conversation back in March. So there's a lot to think about here, but I think these four pieces of these household strict rules, the timing of this article being released, Charles joking about being in a cage. Um, and then of course, you know, you have these last two points that I've just mentioned. Things are very bizarre and I think that she is in a position where she cannot leave. She's under duress, she's in a coma, something is slurred, something along those lines, paralysis, something along these lines where she's not allowed to go anywhere. Not only that, but we haven't seen the two younger children anywhere and they bypass photo agencies. So it's obviously very odd. Not only that, but William only speaks about Kim Milton when he's asked. He doesn't speak about her out of his heart to put out statements of affection and affinity. He's only speaking about Kate Middleton when he does his public engagements and the fans that come to see him ask him, how is Kate doing? What is going on? Please give us an update. They are asking. This initiative should come from William's mouth himself, not from other people basically forcing him to answer. So that in itself is very bizarre to me once again. And of course, you know, the children, where are they? You know, where are the two young children? We just shouldn't bring them into this conversation, but they are part of the family. Are they going to school? Are they on school runs? Where have they gone? So a lot of questions from a lot of these articles and think pieces that have been published over the past just 24 hours, guys. Now, a lot of news on the royal family gets published every day because people make money from it. But unfortunately, they can't do that anymore because they're nowhere to be seen. So that, that in itself is a huge issue for them. So believe me, I believe the paparazzi, everybody they are on Kate Middleton to try and find her. The fact that they can't even find a picture of this woman walking or talking or whatever that is actually genuine and real is implying to me that she's not even allowed to be out in public, that she's within doors, behind four walls and not allowed to leave. Especially the words of, I'm allowed to be out my cage that Charles said to me hints at a lot of stuff. Subscribe to the channel guys, click that button for daily and consistent content. Please do, I would appreciate it. It's just one click to subscribe. She is still missing in my eyes. We have not seen her. I don't know how this how long this wait is going to be. We anticipated it to be two weeks up to now, three months now, basically up to at, at the end of the year. Is she now also going to be a working royal? The jumps we've made in this whole situation is insane. Absolutely insane. Subscribe to the channel, guys. Click that button. Please do follow me on my Instagram at Murad underscore Murali. I'm uploading some of my YouTube videos on there now so you guys can watch it in short form. I would appreciate it and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.